Peace and Pan Africanism, peace and Pan Africanism. Peace and Pan Africanism, peace and Pan Africanism. This is your big brother, King Kong Consciousness. This is your big brother, Uncle Ifa Tunde. This is your big brother, the notorious RBG. Live and direct from Miami International. Live and direct from Miami International. Live and direct from Miami International. I'm on my way to build in reason and politic with our Guadalupean African brothers and sisters. I'm on my way to the Caribbean Sea to build with our Guadalupean African brothers and sisters. I'm headed to the French Empire this morning. I'm headed to the French Empire this morning to build and organize with our Guadalupean brothers and sisters in the Caribbean. And then next week, I'll be headed to South America to build and organize with our Guyanese African brothers and sisters. Next week will be my first ever visit to the country of Guyana. Rest in paradise to Walter Rodney. I'm looking forward to meeting all my brothers and sisters in the powerful black nation of Guyana in South America. But I wanna say this. Good Garvey Day to my continental Africans. The Africa trip information will be coming out momentarily. Just trying to work out a few, few glitches. The Africa group trip information for the last week of July, first week in August will be coming out momentarily. Just trying to work out a few glitches. Make sure you hit that cash app, dollar sign FDMG school. Make sure you hit that cash app, dollar sign FDMG school. Make sure you hit that PayPal, paypal.me slash FDMG Academy. Miami International Airport, Guadalupe, let's make it pop. Miami International Airport, Guadalupe, let's make it pop. Next week, Guyana, let's make it pop. South Africa, I'm trying to see if we moving forward with the men's conference in South Africa. My South African brothers and sisters, we trying to see if the men's conference at the church in South Africa is still going to be moving forward. My Toronto, Canada Africans, I'll see you in June. My Toronto, Canada Africans, I will see you in June. My Australian Africans, Australian Africans, I will see you in June. But I want to say this, family. You have to find your purpose in life or your life will be miserable. Where there is no purpose, there will be pain. Where there is no purpose, there will be pain. Too many Africans are simply surviving, but you're not thriving. And the reason so many of us are simply surviving and we are not thriving is because we have not yet found our life's purpose. Every life has a purpose. That's the foundation of African cosmology, particularly from a Yoruba perspective. Our spiritual system is called Ifa, destiny, finding and fulfilling your destiny. My name is Ifa Tunde. Destiny has returned. Your destiny is to fulfill your purpose. Do you know what it is? Too many women laying around waiting for a man to give them a purpose. It don't work like that. It don't work like that. Too many black women waiting for a man to give them a purpose. 
It don't work like that. Your purpose don't come from a man. Your purpose comes from God. Your purpose was fixed before you came into this world through your mother's legs. Find and fulfill your purpose. Raising beautiful children, that's a part of your purpose. It's never the sum total. Raising beautiful children is part of your purpose. It's never the sum total. For my brothers out there, you just waking up smoking weed, hanging on the block, doing your nine to five. Where is your purpose? Most depressed people don't know their purpose. Hopeless people don't have a purpose. The reason why so many of our young people are on the streets stealing, killing, and shooting, they don't have no purpose. It's insane here at the Miami International Airport. It's absolutely insane here. We must stay focused, brothers. But the reason our young people are robbing, killing, and stealing, the reason our young people are robbing, killing, and stealing is because we have allowed public school to deprive them of finding their purpose. Part of education is helping a child find out their purpose. Black Queens forever, snow bunnies never. Black Queens forever, snow bunnies never. Black Queens forever, snow bunnies never. So we allow public school, we allow public school to rob our children of their purpose. There's nothing worse. There's nothing worse. There's nothing worse. than to see so many black men shuffled into prison. How are you gonna live your purpose from a prison cell? Now don't get me wrong. Some people may have a purpose that include some partial incarceration. I don't know your destiny. Your destiny might include some partial incarceration. But in America, we're not dealing with partial incarceration. We have a lot of sand bunnies on the chat. We have a lot of sand bunnies on the chat. Peace and Pan-Africanism to the sand bunnies. Peace and Pan-Africanism to the sand bunnies. But in America, in America, we have a school to prison pipeline that's robbing black men of their divine purpose. In America, we have a school to prison pipeline that's robbing black men of their divine purpose. In America, we have a school to prison pipeline that is depriving black boys of their purpose. And let me say, what is a sand bunny? I'll let you figure that out. What is a sand bunny? I'll let you figure that out. Ice bunnies, sand bunnies, mountain bunnies, cave bunnies, sand bunnies, mountain bunnies, desert bunnies. How do we end the school to prison pipeline, Brother Devin? How do we end the school to prison pipeline, Brother Devin? It's real simple. And I'm glad you asked the question. Sand bunnies are now taking over the live. I already got snow bunnies. Now I got sand bunnies. This shit is getting ridiculous. Listen, snow bunnies and sand bunnies, I know I'm handsome. I know some of you are sapiosexuals. You are drawn to the intelligence of King Kong. I understand. Some of you, it ain't about the melanin. It's about the intelligence. I understand. But snow bunnies, sand bunnies, mountain bunnies, I need you to understand. I am the property of African feminine energy. I can only recharge 
with a melanated queen. And this is what the bunny hoppers don't understand. It's a metaphysical reason why you must date black. It's a metaphysical reason why you must stay with the African queens. It's a metaphysical reason why the black man has no business with anything other than the black woman because we recharge each other. Just like a battery in a car. Just like a battery in the car. The positive charges the negative. The negative charges the positive. Only a melanated woman can recharge a melanated man. Only a melanated woman can recharge a melanated man. Only a melanated woman can recharge a melanated man. This is why when you see black men who keep pumping a melanin into sand and snow, when you come across a black man who keep pumping a melanin into sand and snow, When you see a black man who keep pumping their melanin into sand and snow, they're off, they have a weak aura. Bunny hoppers have a very weak aura. How many times you've been around a bunny hopper who had a strong vibration, a strong African vibration? They don't have that because they're being drained by sand, snow, and mountain. The ice is kryptonite for the melanin. The ice, stay away from the ice. So no disrespect to the sand bunnies and no disrespect to the ice bunnies and no disrespect to the mountain bunnies or the cave bunnies, but I'm only interested in the sun queens. The queens of the sun. If it ain't melanin drip, you must acquit. If it ain't melanin drip, you must acquit. Rest in peace to Johnny Cochran. If it ain't melanin drip, you must acquit. If it ain't melanin drip, it will not fit. If it ain't melanin drip, it will not fit. But I'm going to go back to my brother's question. Hit the cash app. Who coming to paint day? Today is Sunday, so if you want to paint at the FDMG Paint Weekend, you can now text me as long as you have donated. I'm going to make it a million, a minimum donation of $100. If you have donated at least $100 to the Frederick Douglass Marcus Garvey Academy and you want to come and be a Paint Day, Paint Weekend volunteer, text myself. If you have donated at least $100 to the Frederick Douglass Marcus Garvey Academy and you would like to be a Paint Weekend volunteer, Text my phone, 215-989-9858, 215-989-9858, if you want to volunteer for Paint Weekend, if you want to volunteer for Paint Weekend, Black Queens Forever, Sand Bunnies Never, Black Queens Forever, Cave Bunnies Never, Black Queens Forever, Mountain Bunnies Never, listen. Listen, brothers and sisters. You got the name wrong, Big Scorpio Vibes. It's 9858, Big Scorpio Vibes. 215-989-9858. Me and Nick Cannon just getting started. Me and my brother, Nick Cannon. That's only one episode. We got about three episodes. You got two more episodes. The first episode with me and Nick Cannon on Council Culture is about school to prison pipeline. You got to watch the Snow Bunny episode that me and Nick Cannon did. You got to watch the Snow Bunny episode that me and Nick Cannon did. You got to watch the Black Male Celebrities Wearing Skirts episode that me and Nick Cannon did. You got to watch the Black Male Celebrities Wearing Skirts episode that me and Nick Cannon did. <laughs> I love it. Sand bunnies, snow bunnies, and rice bunnies. Sand bunnies, snow bunnies, and rice bunnies. Sand bunnies, snow bunnies, rice bunnies. Say no to the sand bunny. Say no to the sand bunny. Say no to the rice bunny. Say no to the rice bunny. 
Say no to the ice and snow bunny. Say no to the ice and snow bunny. If it ain't a garden bunny, if it ain't a sun bunny, oh yes. Where those brown sun bunnies? Where those caramel sun bunnies? Where those chocolate fudge bunnies? Oh yes. Oh yes. But my brother asked the question. <laughs> <laughs> he got him a rice bunny he went and got him a rice bunny he went and got him a cave bunny he went and got him a sand bunny this shit is crazy <laughs> he said an egg roll bunny this shit is crazy Egg roll and rice bunny. Egg roll and rice bunny. This shit is crazy. Egg roll and rice bunny. We got ice and cave bunny. <laughs> oh, man. You went and got you a burrito bunny. You went and got you a burrito bunny. This shit is crazy. He said he went and got him a burrito bunny. Burrito bunnies, snow bunnies, rice bunnies, sand bunnies, burrito bunnies. <laughs> the brother said, why we don't have, how do we stop the school to prison pipeline? How do we stop the school to prison pipeline? How do we <laughs> How do we stop the school to prison pipeline? The only bunny you should have is a black bunny. If it ain't a black bunny, Brother, we stopped the school to prison pipeline by building our own schools. How do you stop poor health care? You build your own hospitals. How do you stop unemployment? You build your own economy. We got to build our own family. We need infrastructure. Infrastructure. You ain't black, my nigga. Start small. I have a problem with you start small, Negroes, and I'm gonna tell you why. I have a problem with you, let's just start small, Negroes. You know why I have a problem with you start small, Negroes? The reason I have a problem with you start small Negroes is y'all never start small when y'all out buying those Mercedes and BMWs. Y'all never start small. Y'all never start small when y'all buying pocketbooks and high heels. Y'all never start small when y'all buying Air Jordans and, 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 and Yeezys. Y'all don't start small when y'all buy y'all cologne. Y'all don't start small when y'all buy y'all weaves and wigs. Y'all don't start small when y'all go on vacation. We never start small when we buying useless bullshit for ourselves. We never start small when we're buying for ourselves but the minute somebody says we need to build some institutions the minute somebody says we need to build some institutions <laughs> <laughs>